What's up, you guys? This is Karmic and Dane's Tantan, where we talk about karmic situations that could be going on in your life at this time that you need to be aware of, or this could just be confirmation that you made the right decision or you're currently making the right decision. Archangel, spirit guides, ancestors, and my highest good, please come in and protect me as I channel this current ancestor message for the collective spirit. Ancestor message for the collective. Thank you guys for all the likes, the shares, the comments, the subscribes, the emails, the bookings, the donations. I appreciate you guys for all the love and the support you show to me and the channel. I appreciate y'all. Alright, so we have remember who you are. Focus on children. And we have find your voice. Okay, so for a lot of you guys... You could be like really coming into realization about who you were or who you were in the past life or who you are, period. Okay? For some of you guys, you could be realizing that you want to adopt something or you want to start having children or you want to birth something new. Okay? I feel like that you guys are going to be expressing yourself and opening up. Your ancestors are guiding you at this time. I feel like that connecting with water is a big thing for you right now all right connecting with water current energy current ancestor message a lot of you guys i'm hearing like you could be like fertile right now so if you're not trying to get pregnant you know don't be out here like you know what i'm saying taking no risk or nothing <laughs> okay because i am feeling like somebody could be very like fertile at this time so, if you're not trying to get pregnant, now is not the time to be taking risks. Okay? Current energy. Adjustments are required. So, there's adjustments that are required in a situation. When it comes to igniting your passions. Okay? What else? Your dreams need a practical plan. One more. You are good enough. And the answers you need are coming. Bottom of the deck, we have dream and journey. Okay? So, what I'm getting is, for a lot of you guys, you could be needing to do a little bit more healing in a situation. Okay, when it comes to igniting your passions. Yep, that's what I'm seeing. So for a lot of you guys, it's like you need to like really be connecting with water at this time. Because your ancestors are guiding you to like open up. Okay, in a situation. I'm hearing your ancestors say, remember who you are. Like, come on now, like remember who you are. You already know who you are. You the top of the top kind of energy. You're resilient, okay? Keep being resilient. Something to do with a Gemini, Virgo, or a Taurus. All right? Somebody could be going through a very hard time. And, you know, you could be feeling like real down or feeling like you're not good enough. Okay? So, it could be something that you're passionate about, but you feel like you're not good enough. Or you're, you feel like you're not good enough to start it. Or you just feel like you're not good enough. But I'm hearing that you are good enough. Okay? Adjustments are required. What's this adjustments are required? Three of Pentacles. Okay, so when it comes to whatever it is that you're building up. Okay, something to do with Taurus could be significant. Yeah, Two of Wands. For some of y'all, you need to be uh, making plans when it comes to whatever you're building up. Yeah. Yeah. Because I'm hearing that they are here to help you balance some shit out when it comes to some energy. For some of y'all, it could be really hard. You could have a you could have like a toxic energy that's trying to attach to whatever it is that you're building up. But I'm hearing that your ancestors of your highest good is giving you some kind of information that's gonna help you balance some shit out. Okay? But you need to make some adjustments though is what i'm hearing okay so whatever adjustments that you are being led to do okay i'm hearing that that's gonna help you ignite um 
I'm hearing ignite the passion back in what you do because for some of y'all, this could be something that you currently currently do. All right, and this is whatever something new is, it's gonna ignite the passion back within you. Okay, it's gonna ignite it back. All right. For some of y'all, this could just be life. You know, somebody could just be bored with life. You know, maybe somebody could be living, you know, good and content. But maybe now you could be focusing on maybe adopting children, getting pregnant, different things like that. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I'm hearing that for some of y'all, your shift is, is changing with what you're focusing on and stuff like that. All right. I'm hearing as you connect with water, you're going to get more and more clarity about the direction that you need to make when it comes to making plans, you know, in your life, when it comes to your dreams and stuff like that. All right. I'm hearing that, you know, you got to cleanse out your energy of all the bullshit. You know, you got to make sure you're cleaning out your energy well. Yeah. So your ancestors of your highest good want you to know that you are good enough. And the answers that you need are coming to you. All right. For some of y'all, you be, you could be, like you know, like confused when it comes to your career path. You know, for some of y'all, you could have reached a, um, like a stalemate kind of energy where it's like, okay, where do I go with this? You know, where do I go with this platform or where do I go with this idea? What else can I do? Like, you know, you could be like in that kind of vibe. Okay. But it's like, you know, you could be needing to like, I'm hearing draw out a new plan. So for some of you guys, your ancestors is telling you to draw out a new plan. It's time for a new plan. It's time for something new. And you are good enough to ignite this passion that you feel within yourself. You are good enough for it. All right. So if this is like birthing a new project, you're good enough. Okay? Yeah. So something to do with a Taurus, a Virgo, a Gemini, a Sagittarius. Okay? Current energy. Okay, what else? Current energy, King of Roses, diversity. Okay, Uriel. All right, so what I'm getting with this energy for a lot of you guys, I am seeing that if this got something to do with your business or something that you could be about to start, I'm hearing whatever it is that you're about to start. You're going to quickly find out that this is like, you're going to get a lot of like, it's it's like a lot of different ways you can make money with this. So whatever this is that you're about to start, you're going to realize like, damn, I can make money this way, this way, that way, this way. Like you're going to realize that it's so many ways to like get something accomplished. Like once you start it though, you're going to be like, man, I didn't know. You know, you're going to be like, Wow. Yeah, the lookout. Because your ancestors are always looking out for you. Always. Yeah, setting up your course. Initiation. So for a lot of you guys, this is some kind of initiation. Yeah, the sands of time. Alright? So definitely, you guys are going through some kind of initiation at this time. So you guys are led to ignite some kind of passion within yourself. Whatever passion that you have within yourself, your ancestors of your highest good is guiding you to ignite it, okay? Like take action with it is what I'm hearing. Because you're going to realize that once you do that, you done opened up a lot of doors in a lot of different areas, okay? You're going to realize that. Yep, I'm hearing that for a lot of you guys. It's like behind the scenes, there could be a contract coming towards you. Okay, like there's a contract being drawn out for you right now. Okay, that somebody wants to come towards you with. Okay. Yeah, that's what I'm seeing. Something to do with 17, 14, 35, 53, 55. 
Yeah. So I'm hearing, yeah, that there, there could be somebody watching you. They setting up a contract with you right now. For some of y'all, this could be something you already into. For others, if you are being led to, to start something, go ahead on and do it. Because when I'm seeing, you're going to be like so happy with how things turn out. You're going to be very happy. You're going to be very satisfied with how some things turn out. With how this turn out in your energy. Yeah, you're, you're not going to be disappointed is what I'm hearing. Yeah, I'm telling you, this going to make you into a very privileged individual. Yes, you're going to get unexpected money in every which way. Yeah, you're going to be definitely taken care of. House. Yep. Court. For some of y'all, this could be custody. Somebody could be in custody of some children. <clears throat> yep, somebody could be getting custody of some children and help with the house. Wow. So somebody is getting custody of their child, custody of their children, and a house or help with a house. Yeah, I'm here for a lot of you guys. Your ancestor, there could have been court that took place in the ethers. And I'm hearing that you're about to get some unexpected income coming in. But your ancestors of your highest good is guiding you through ways to get this unexpected income that you could be needing or wanting for a home or wanting for a property or needing for a property. Okay, so follow like the voice of your soul when it comes to igniting something within you. All right, that's what I'm hearing real strong. All right. Okay. Current energy. Current energy. I heard Christopher. Something to do with Christopher or Christina. All right. Chris. Something with Chris. Something to do with an Aries could be significant. Somebody could be a life path number four. All right. What else? current energy I heard Michael okay I heard Mindy something with Mindy I heard Cynthia all right Trevor all right all right 70s could be significant Boxers, we have T, X, something to do with a Pisces could be significant. We have R, I heard Rex, colorful nails, somebody could be light skin, Hacker. All right, something to do with Aquarius, Vietnamese, Japanese, Chinese, and or Korean. We have N. CEO, suspense movies, short hair waves, somebody can have a bald head, we have L, Nike, lace and or silk panties, we have briefs, janitor or housekeeper, we have dresses, B, kind panties, Dark skin tone. We have Aquarius. Actress, actor. Factory worker. Somebody can have a chill vibe. Colored hair. We have Q. B. E. Stripper. Love jeans. All right. Something with the extraterrestrial as well or ET kind of energy. Okay. Somebody name could be L E T L E B. All right. I'm hearing somebody could have made a bet up against you and they lost. Okay? That's also what I'm hearing. Okay, 
Somebody name could be R E N R E T. Okay, I heard Braylon. Something with Braylon. Somebody could play basketball. I heard New Orleans. I heard Nyla. Something with 34, 24, 43, 42. Somebody could be 22. Something to do with 22. 2022, 2023. Okay. I heard Trinity. I heard Tren. T R E N. Okay. I heard Brenton. Something with Brenton. Okay. Something with Lexus. All right. All right, you guys. I heard Lenny. Something to do with Lenny could be significant as well. All right, you guys. I'm going to leave it there, but your ancestors are saying that you are going to get your the dreams. You know, your dreams are going to be fulfilled on your journey okay but I'm hearing right now connect with water and get yourself tuned in and connected because I'm hearing that you're gonna get some information on how to I'm hearing like transmute some energy or transmute something okay for some of y'all all right this could have something to do with like even like for some of y'all that's not feeling good enough if this got something to do with like any kind of manipulation all right you're gonna get some information from your ancestors on how to like change that energy around within yourself okay is what i'm hearing all right you guys i really hope this helps somebody in some shape or form like comment and subscribe Look in the description box below for any other information about me. And until next time, peace.